I'm going to share what's on my iPhone 10 or my iPhone X. I'm going to share with you what are the apps that I use from editing videos or my pictures and thumbnails for my YouTube videos and what just basically makes me busy with my phone. So I got this January and it's pretty funny because before I didn't know how to even screenshot pictures because I've, I'm used to using the home button. I got the 64 gigabyte storage. I got the black um, iPhone X or iPhone 10. I got this casing for $25. I'm into bedazzled casing. I got it from Pacific Mall if you're from Toronto. You know what I'm talking about? Pacific Mall has lots, lots, lots of casing. To start off with my wallpaper, of course, it's my family. That's my husband and my little girl. And let's get started with the app. So you will see the apps on this screen right here. This is what my home screen or my background looks like. So as you can see, I'm so into cherry blossoms and since it's springtime almost here in Toronto, I'm already in the mood for some cherry blossoms and some flowers. So this is how it looks like for my home screen and and how I organize my apps. So I start with my messages. I have my calendar here, my photos, and my camera. I have my notes because I just take notes like all the time. I have my calculator, weather and the clock, also FaceTime, the maps, the app store. As you can see, I also have the settings there. I'm not going to touch on the accounts because those are basically my account, my bank, and like the service provider that I'm with, which I'm not gonna touch. For privacy, I also have my emails here. And these extras are basically the apps that I don't really use. So there's lots here, actually. So I have compass, tips, voice memos, documents, podcast, home, iBooks, whatever you see on the screen. Uber, I'm not, I don't really leave the house alone, so I just had that just in case. On this extras, I don't usually use the apps, so I just put them all together. So let's go on with the social media. So I have my Instagram right here. So please do follow me, and this is um, Justine Haley. And these are the pictures that I have. So I would be more than happy to see you on my Instagram. And the next one is I have a Facebook app here. So I'm not going to touch that because um, we are on a joint account with my husband. I have my messenger here. You can, you can definitely add me on my Snapchat. Um, so you can scan my Snapchat. So yeah, it's just Dean underscore Haley. So this is my YouTube um, channel. This is where I check my YouTube. And I have my YouTube studio. That's basically where I check my analytics. I also have my influencer. So influencer is basically an app where I make reviews for some products. I love influencer. I just got my, my first box box just a couple of weeks ago. I got a free socks. So next one is Pinterest so these are my go-to for ideas and lately I've been searching for anything about mom life so that's pretty much what's on my Pinterest also have the Chica app here um, the Chica app basically is the app that I use to text my family back home in the Philippines and I also have Skype so that is basically all I have for the social now on to the wallpapers. I actually downloaded this girly wallpapers because it's so nice. Like it filters everything already. If you wanna change your background depending on your mood. Um, if you download it from like Google or whatever website you go to, sometimes it's pixelated. But with this um, app, it actually filters out everything for you. 
from what you see here, it says, let's say, you have Valentine's Day styled food. Um, I got this from my background. I got it from flowers. So, so many beautiful flowers for background since we're already approaching the spring season. And I also got... So we also have this... Yeah, there's so much stuff to choose from for your background. So the glittery, this is actually so nice. Oh, this is actually really good. Keep calm and sparkle on. So nice. So yeah, so that's it for the girly wallpapers. So next is I got this Coco Pa. And it's an app which is more of like kawaii. Um, background and as you can see there's already like customized backgrounds and also how the, the apps looks like like if you want to change the icon so yeah it's so cute so that's for my wallpapers now on to my favorite editor for my photos and videos First off, we have Fonto. So yeah, this is one of the apps that I use to edit my thumbnail. And next to that, I also use the PicMonkey. Every YouTuber has to have um, PicMonkey to edit their thumbnail. Next, I got Photofy. Um, I also use this to edit my pictures. I have Quick. This is also um, a cute app that I used before and it's basically like a kawaii app like let's say let me just um, show you guys an example and yeah so you can just put some cute stamps like whatever you feel like or <laughs> yeah so this is actually so cute so whatever you feel like um, And next I have Facetune and UCAM makeup, of course, if you have any blemishes. So those are the um, apps for makeup, like a little bit of editing that you need. I also have RD Magic, Rona Designs. So it's basically like beautiful backgrounds as well that you can put your pictures on and whatever you feel like. So. I also have Picklay. So this Picklay is basically when you wanted to do like an overlay for your pictures. I also have Maldiv for my editor. All of these apps are really recommendable. And for my favorite video editor, of course, iMovie is a must. And I also have Filmora Go. Filmora Go is basically um, it gives you more transitions. Um, iMovie, I've been using it when I was starting off YouTube. I have Snapseed, ColourPop, PhotoLab, Camera360, yeah, and three and PicMonkey. So, so I also have the photo collage um, apps here. So for the Pick Play Post, this is basically an app that you can put all your videos and pictures all together so while it's moving like you know like the videos and pictures you can put it on all um, one like one tile or like in one collage so yeah it's really it's really nice um, I also have photo grid which basically it's still um it's all about collage I have Rona collage I have so many apps for collage. I also have InstaSize um, just in case if um, my picture doesn't fit uh, my Instagram. I have no crop um, and InstaShot. So next is the photo transfers. So this basically is just the play memories. This is where I transfer my photos whatever I whenever I have a shoot from my my vlogging camera um, this is where I transfer my pictures uh, play memories 
and um, I also have the mobile manager. This is basically the USB that I put from my phone to also transfer my files. That's the app. I have the repost app and the sender. Um, sender, I usually use this um, because my husband is using an Android phone, so whatever we just um, use Sender to transfer photos. And on to the next page, I have Bitmoji. So this is what my Bitmoji looks like. Yeah, so I came up with that because this is my style. Uh, let's see here. I kind of wanted to with you how my bitmoji looks like and let me know if it's like me <laughs> let's see um, well yeah that's my bitmoji and the next one is soundhound i have this app because whenever i hear a song and it listens to the song and it's gonna give you the title so cool so yeah, and um, I also have Cineplex here um, just to check out the movies, whatever me and my husband, you know, feel like watching. And I also usually check my points. I also have Zoom, which is basically I use for work. And down below, so I have my phone, my email, Safari. So that's just basically my channel and um, I also have music here I don't usually download much music because it um, takes up so much space on my phone but I just have my you know like Drake here on my playlist so yeah so pretty much that's it you guys for my what's on my iPhone X or my what's on my iPhone 10 those are pretty much the apps that makes me busy so if you like this video please don't forget to give me a big thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe you guys thank you so much for staying with me and watching my video catch you guys later